Laden faced the music as he takes responsibility for illegal gun. Teach them! Always make sure the message I reach them! Viewers, oftentimes when members of the entertainment fraternity cross paths with the security forces, the common cries that the system will fight them. I threw them get to youth, people bad mind, and them innocent. No, this is a far cry from the path a dancehall DJ Ladna has taken. And unlike many of his colleagues, he has taken full responsibility for his infraction. The embattled Singh J pleaded guilty to charges of illegal possession of firearm and illegal possession of ammunition. When he appeared in the St. Elizabeth Circuit Court in Black River on Monday afternoon, the 30th of November, as was mentioned in a previous video. Ladin, whose given name is O'Keefe Aaron, appeared before High Court Judge Justice Evan Brown with his attorneys Thomas Levine and Jody Taylor. Now, according to sources, Ladin admitted in court that he was the owner of the 9mm high point pistol, which was reportedly tossed from the sunroof of a motor car during a police chase on the 28th of October. The 33 year old entertainer has been in police custody since he was charged jointly with 21 year old Cyanie Banks and a 16 year old boy who is believed to be the entertainer's brother. He is also charged with breaching the Disaster Risk Management Act by being on the street after the island wide 9 pm curfew and failing to stop at the request of the police. Asked as to why Laden pleaded guilty, his attorney Levine said it was the only way out for his client. Mr. Aaron had given specific instructions to me and having looked at his instructions and having looked at what the law says, it was explained to him the situation he was in and he understood that the only way out is for him to accept responsibility and that was when things took a turn and he decided to amend his representation, Levine said. Laden was previously represented by attorney at law Charles Benbow. The court has ordered a social inquiry report, while Laden's attorneys indicated that they will be calling for character witnesses at sentencing. The two other people arrested with the entertainer were acquitted of gun charges. After the prosecution, led by Senior Deputy Director of Public Prosecutions, Jeremy Taylor, Queen's Counsel, withdrew charges against them. Meanwhile, head of the St. Elizabeth Police Division, Deputy Superintendent Narda Sims is urging Jamaicans to take note of Ladin's conviction. It will be a precedent to all criminals that if you carry an illegal firearm and you are caught, then you will go to prison, Sims said. Teach them! Hey yo, hello! Send the message and make it reach them. It's teach them right here, Warlord representing. Thank you for watching. Like the video before you go. Please subscribe if you haven't done so. And remember to share the video with your friends and family. And browse the channel for more quality content. Until next time, walk good, my friends. Teach them!